Um, and I'll count it down. I'll count it down and then explain. I don't think that was the, faster at all. <laughs> I'll explain the character selection reasons. Um, I actually might be able to do this. So uh, we pick someone who can either do a front flip or a back flip uh, due to the N64 version allowing you to spin and give you a stupid amount of points very quickly with multipliers. Are right, you guys ready? Uh, yeah. All right, three, two, one, go. Um, so Jamie Thomas has a front flip, um, which George prefers, but most other people will be doing back flips with Jeff Rowley. Um, Jamie Thomas also has an easier grind, um, but it's all preference. Um, yeah. They actually differ in routes right here too. Uh, George is doing the task route, and it can tend to be a little more difficult. Yeah. Um, he was supposed to get a rail at the beginning on the ramp and jump over to the E, but he missed it. And then... Uh, Wished and Remedy, oh, and they're doing the one that we learned originally. So right here, Gwish is about to do a wall ride up to the awning. Um, he missed it, and he's going to retry. It's actually, it saves him about 15 seconds, I believe, um, if he hits this trick. Uh, George is about to attempt it as well. Um, so that's going to get them right up to the secret tape. Um, and in any percent, this is a massive time saver. 100% um, it is as well, but it's not as noticeable just due to the other goals they have to get. Um, the rest of this level is pretty much just going through a route. There's no more really hard tricks after this. Uh, a big thing also is getting special. Uh, you get it as quickly as possible because it gives you a speed boost anytime you do a special trick. And speed is also lost the longer time you spend on the ground, so they try to do fast plants to retain their speed. Uh, Gwish is going back here to get, I believe, the secret tape. He tried to throw in some swag with the uh, <laughs> kickflip to Indy. <laughs> <laughs> Never do a kickflip to Indy. It's going to kill you. Uh, George is here in Mall, which is one of the more fun tracks to do for sure. Um, it's a point to point, so you go from the top and the run will actually end at the bottom. Um, we stop before then because we're fast, but. Uh, this secret tape jump he's going for right now can give a lot of people trouble, and he hit it no problem. Um, you're supposed to go from a different ledge, um, but it's much quicker to go this way and skip a whole sequence of turning around. The game is also very technical, so if you mess up, it's very easy to yeah. get frustrated and lose track of where you're going. Especially in later levels where the levels are more vertical and if you fall you lose a ton of time and there's nothing you can do about it. Um, so here's our first uh, showing of a competition. There's a kind of a gap of points you need to hit. The CPUs can get within a certain range and their overalls will vary about two points up or down. Um, so in Chicago there it's about 15,000 and you'll be okay. Um, and we have those down pretty quick. Uh, this is another skip uh, in sh down, which one's this? Downtown. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Um, where George is right now, and previously we thought it was only a task strat, and then George actually experimented with it quite a while, and you can actually jump on the building and get the secret tape. We did. Oh, what? Okay. We were all experimenting, and it's, uh, it's extremely difficult, but if done properly can save uh, quite a few seconds, and a few seconds off of an already very short run of being about seven minutes or less uh, is massive. So it's actually pretty cool to see them this close to each other. Yeah, um, especially is... because they were down yeah. about a level, so it's really easy to catch up in this game with proper execution and really easy to fall behind. Yeah. Uh, this is a fun strat that George just did. You can go through the bottom of that and not clip, but still get the T. Um, it's actually kind of deceptive how tricky it can be. That ramp that you jump off of uh, doesn't give you much time to put the inputs. Uh, coming into downhill here, uh, a lot of people remember this level very vividly, and we hate this level. Uh, it has some of the hardest tricks in yeah, the run. There's one in particular we'll talk about when we get there. Um, but this is one of the vertical levels I was talking about where if you miss a letter or a valve or uh, the tape, you're losing very easily 15, 20 seconds, if not more. Um, so right here, he's gonna come and hit the A and grind across this. This was at once believed to be a task only strat, 
Um, but after some manipulation with the way we do it, and that was fantastic. That was really good. Um, it's extremely tough. The fast plant has to be very perfect, and you have to have full speed. Um, so that's why we do the backflip before, because it gives you a speed boost? Yeah. The, the TAS actually skips the backflip, but gets a special grind on the rail before it, and cuts a retarded angle. Um, Gwish right now is doing 180s to hopefully get a special trick. Yeah. And it's tough when you miss that. You pretty much have to restart the level eventually. Uh, burn side again, it's just quick tricks. Um, I think this one's about 25 or 30,000 you need. Um, typically, a backflip 720 off the first ramp will give you the score you need, and you can get out. Um, so Remedy and George right now are pretty close here. They're really neck and neck because a few seconds can mean the world in this game. Yeah. Um, this is the slowest part of the run turning to get this K. Uh -huh. It's the most aggravating too because you're a blind drop onto that cop car and if you don't hit the grind you have to spend your time figuring out where you are. Uh, we're coming up to the secret tape jump for this, and they're going to do a little skip here. It's nothing difficult, but it saves a ton of time from having to go around. So, oh God. <laughs> <laughs> so George is pretty happy right now, um, but it all comes down to the secret tape jump. This is extremely finicky. Um, any kind of bobble will not get you it. And uh, nice job. So what's, what's pretty impressive is he actually almost cleared the tape. Um, and that can actually be more devastating than just missing it. Nice. The bonks, dude. Um, so a good time out of San Francisco uh, on your clock left is uh, anywhere in the 30s you can be happy with. So George is actually on a really solid pace right now. And the bonks come in. You get yeah, that's a, that's a pretty solid time. It's something to be happy about. Um, time is actually coming up pretty quick here. So this is the last contest that George is going into. Um, it's, I mean, all the contests are pretty much the same. Just throw a backflip and no, spin. No, only 720. <laughs> <laughs> so he actually messed up. A 900 backflip there can give you a pretty heavy uh, point differential between a 720 and a 900. Uh, <laughs> Remedy actually has a pretty good chance of catching him right here with good execution and the fact that George can't backflip. Backflip, thanks. Sorry. No! <laughs> good job. Oh, it's close. That's... Bro, no, 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 no! You didn't get it! No, time! <laughs> The thing about 100% is you need all golds, and to come up bronze like that is heartbreaking. It's pure RNG. It is, yeah, it's completely RNG because we're cutting the points so close so we don't have to do another jump <laughs> that you can sometimes, and it's usually Buck Elastic because no one likes him, will come and <laughs> snipe you and uh, steal away your gold, and uh, nobody likes him. So, you yeah. know, sorry, Bucky. Sorry. <laughs> All right, well, if you guys have a, a moment, I'd like to read some donations. Oh, that's not, that's, not, not, bad, that's, that's not bad. Um, <laughs> actually, the, the world record has been beaten several times since we've been here for 100%. Yeah, three times. Three times. Uh, first, it was Remedy. No, it was George. Uh, it was actually. George first. Um, it was like 712. Yeah, they got a 712. Then Remedy did, uh, yeah, he cut the 7, 655, and George didn't appreciate that and pulled the 645. Um, there were still mistakes in the run, uh, from what he says, but uh, they weren't anything too major. It was a few seconds. Um, but Remedy actually holds a record for any percent, and that run is godlike. It's actually under five minutes. It's a 4.57, if I remember correctly. Yeah. And if you look that up, um, you can YouTube it or just find it on his Twitch profile. Yeah, it's a fantastic run. It's, it's insane. <laughs> so, Steve right now, uh, Gwished, it did the best cheat code in any game. Uh, <laughs> a lot of people think it's a Konami code, but it's not. 
Uh, it's actually Tony Hawk's wife's face. Uh, don't know why it's in the game. Uh, but, you know, it's fun to do runs like that. Uh, you know. It reduces lag on the screen. Yep. <laughs> we don't know if that's true, but we hope it is, because we do it, so. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well.